third RR Retriever. The shell components has made the flow feature more user friendly. You are now able to have multiple layers of the process or call as a parallel process under one flow group. Compared to visual components 4.4, you only allow to have one layer of a process for each flow group. In visual components 4.4, there are only two ways to insert a process into the flow steps. Either manually add a process or automatically add it by clicking on the components label. But after upgrading, Another way to add a process into the flow step is by dragging the components label to the flow editor and placing it in the sequence that you want. You also have an option to make the certain process optional. What will happen is, the product will skip this optional process if the next process is available. Otherwise, it will stop at the optional process while waiting for the next process to be available. Interesting part, instead of going to the processors to open the process statement panel, you can directly right-click on the label to open it from the flow editor. And lastly, now you can get information from the flow editor through the process statements. Enjoy the new flow feature. Subscribe for bi-weekly updates. Thank you and bye.